Hey, I'm Jim with GME Supply, and in this video I'm going to show you how to rig up the Sterling Pocket Hauler for use. Uh, for an overview of the Pocket Hauler or any of our other products, check us out at uh, gmesupply.com. Okay, so as you can see here, we have all of the components to the system. Um, and this is the way that it shows up at your front door, uh, all disassembled like this. So uh, let's go ahead and get started on this. First thing we're going to do is take our quick link and um, our, one of our double sheave pulleys, put those together. And then we'll take our terminated end of the eight millimeter rope, put it on there and go ahead and close this off. We're done with this point at, at, uh, at this section here. Let's give ourselves some uh, room to work here. Now, one thing you wanna make sure that you're gonna do is give yourself plenty of rope to work with so you're not gonna get bound up and, and in the way of what you're doing. Uh, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna start with the bottom side of the pulley. So one thing to make sure is that these pulleys are facing opposite of each other. So we'll start rigging from the bottom. You go from one to the other, open up your pulley and pull it through. And the really cool thing is once you're done with that, you can go ahead and close it and you don't have to worry about it anymore. So that's pretty simple. So then we did the, the yellow side on this one. We'll come down here to this pulley, open up the yellow side as well, and uh, we're done with the bottom part. So now we're gonna switch and go up to the top, do the same thing. Remember to leave yourself enough rope to work with. Close that up. Same thing here on this red side. Okay. So now what we've done is we've rigged up the basic four to one system. Uh, as you can see, the way we start is you go back and forth four times, and so there's your four to one mechanical advantage. Um, one thing we can do now is take our triple locking carabiners and close the pulleys off so we don't have to worry about them opening up and letting the rope out. Okay, so that part's done. Now what we have is our system makes it easy to pick things up, but what we don't have is a progress capture device. So if I was gonna pull on this, uh, this system and pick up a load, if I was gonna let it go, the load would fall to the ground. So what we need to do is use this prusik that acts like a fist. And as you can see, I have fingers that wrap around and grab onto the rope. And that's basically what you'll do with this. Um, so one thing that we wanna do is find where our anchor rope is, the one that has the eye that's attached to the pulley. And you'll want to start on the rope and actually have that prusik grab the rope. So I want to do this a couple of times, and this is what we call doing a prussic wrap. And so we've, we've wrapped it twice. Uh, with a heavier load, you want to go ahead and wrap it three times. We've got enough prussic cord to do that, and that's going to give us a nice tight, tight wrap. And uh, if you'll notice there, I've got everything nice and pretty. All the ropes are lining up next to each other. Try to keep them from overlapping because this is going to give you the most binding surface that you can get on, the, on that rope and give you the best grip. So then we'll take that, slide it down your prussic binding pulley, and hook it onto the carabiner. And that is basically all you have to do to rig up this system. So whenever you pull on this and pick up your load, your prusik will push down on the mining pulley, open itself up and let the rope slide through. Whenever you release your, your pull, the load is gonna wanna fall back down to the ground. So this is actually gonna pull against that rope and against that pulley, and it's gonna grab onto the rope and, and keep it from, from slipping. So that's basically it right there. We've got a, a four to one system. And if you wanted to flip it over and actually do it as a five to one, you could do that. You flip it over and you add another carabiner here, or another small pulley, and pull it the opposite direction, and that gets you a five to one system. If you have any other questions about how to rig up the Sterling Pocket Hauler system, please give us a call or visit us at gmesupply.com.